Create a responsive email using RED in just five minutes. Start by opening a blank theme. Now click the components icon located on the main toolbar. Select the components you wish to include in your email and then click Add to Project. Now let's add our first component. Go to the Content pane and select the Components tab. Click the plus arrow icon button to add the newsletter header component. Position the row from the layout pane and use the move control by clicking the up icon. Double click the pre-header text heading to open the design pane and click the pencil to edit the text. You can type right on the screen. Repeat the same steps to edit the subheader text element. Press Command A or Control A to select all text. To change the image, double click the image and change the source URL to the image you want to use by adding the image path. Click the Components icon and select the Typography category. From here, you can select the classically styled Key Message component. Select the container that holds the issued text and add the classically styled Key Message component. Change the word Typography to Watchography and apply the EM style to the word watch. Before styling the next row, give it the class name Product Row. Then change the top and bottom padding of the row to 25px. Then select the column and go to the layout pane and divide it into two columns. Click the components icon and select the customer contact category. From here, select the all good component. Next, add the all good component to both columns. Select the Feedback Wrapper container and adjust the left and right margin to 20px. Tweak the styles by reducing the font size and the heading to 25px. Responsive Email Designer features an extensive range of elements that can be inserted and then customized to fit your design requirements and branding. Add a new row, then drag a header 3 element from the content pane. Then style however you wish.
We decided to change the text to say what our customers are saying. Just triple click on screen to be able to add your own text. Click the components icon and select the quotes category. From here, select the customer quote component. Select the quote text element and replace it with your own content. Press Command T or Control T to edit the text and Command A or Control A to select the text. Edit the quotation marks to match the color scheme by changing their font color to 07A584. Add your color swatch to the built-in Color Palette Manager. Click the Components icon and select the Footer Section category. From here, select the Footer Legalities component and add it to the design. Highlight the footer link and apply a font color of 07A584 and underline them. Lastly, it's time to responsify the design. The slider at the top will let you see your creation at different screen sizes. Anytime you see an area that's not its best, you can make changes on the right-hand panel that will take place at that specific size. Adjust the span width from 6 to 12 spans for each column. Doing this will make the item stack. Adjust the top and bottom margin of the feedback wrapper container to 5px. Ta-da! You did it! Now let's preview the finished product by clicking the Preview Toolbar icon.